you're gonna ride, ride hard. <laughs> that's that's what tough guys say, right? <laughs> that's what we say. Brad Dorn, <laughs> the ride hard uh, electric scooter organization represented by this guy. Now listen, Brad, we see rental scooters almost everywhere. Sure. Where people have left them, people are gonna rent them, yep. but you're saying uh, that we can actually have one of our own. Yeah, you can have one of your own, um, starting at around $2,000. And, um, you know, they're all electric, street legal, no title, no license, no registration. Um, you know, we got a lot of people that are buying them for the kids to go to school, for, you know, something like this. You can use it on the golf course, you can take the bag off, and then you can also use it to get around town, go to the store. They're and with it. the three-wheeler, of course, and Pat, on the three-wheeler, there's no tipping. Yeah, there's no tipping. I had a friend that took it out for 10 minutes, said, I can't tip it. So he wanted to get it for his... Uh, <laughs> His elderly grandmother, people are getting for their um, relatives that are disabled. So yeah, this is a, a huge seller. But you also have the adventurous yes, folks yes. who have the two wheelers. And these are really cool looking vehicles too. Who buys these? So um, around here, I, I was just at AZ Bike Week and there were a lot of bikers out there. And so they like buying something like this to take on their RV. Um, if they want to go short runs, then they're not taking their bike out of the garage and you know wearing tearing the engine and having to trickle charge the battery. Uh, uh, Brad, Brad, excuse me for interrupting. No problem. I am so the, boy. the answer to who buys <laughs> is people like Holly. I there know. she goes. Goodbye, <laughs> Holly. It's been wonderful having you. I, I guess I'll be doing the show by myself. I mean as you can see it's so easy even Holly can drive. No it. and quiet. <laughs> yes, there's no noise. Um, although some of the models do come with Bluetooth speakers. And so to the music <laughs> Uh, yes. Bicycle, bicycle. So obviously there's no muffler because there's. All right, and here she comes again. Oh my God, Listen. It's so cool. Oh, Holly looks like she's having the time and, of her life. And if you want it to sound like a motorcycle, so that you still get the feeling that you're riding oh, no, one. No. See, I don't like that when guys go by <laughs> when we're having coffee outside at a sure. cafe somewhere. Yeah, so but, you can just. But you have the turn choice. It off. Turn it off. You have the choice, the remote, everything. The only thing you don't have, once again, though, is the answer to the question, well, where can I drive this? Because if it's just around the driveway no. at your place of business like this. <laughs> it, they, are, they are street legal. So yes. I'm in Chandler. I'm located in Chandler. The rules there is that you can ride it on the road 13 and above on any two lane street that's 35 miles or less. OK, and how far will it go on a charge? These will go 30 miles on a charge. This one can go 60. This one can go 60 with two batteries. These both can hold two batteries. Um, or you can, and you can go up to 25 to 30 miles per hour. And do I have to have a special charger in my house? Nope, it plugs right into your wall socket. Okay, where do they get in touch with you? Quick, Brad. www.ridehardscooters.com. Back up, look out, here comes oh, Holly. And it looks like she's headed this way. <laughs> Just kidding, they're really easy. <laughs>